Here's a jaw dropper to start with. Job postings for generative AI skills have exploded from just 55 in January 2021 to nearly 10,000 by May 2025. That's a growth of almost 200 times in just four years. Generative AI engineers have gone from niche specialists to some of the most sought after professionals in tech. In the US, average base salaries now sit around $116,000, with top earners making as much as $179,000. And that's before bonuses and stock options. So. If you're looking to break into this field, you need more than hype. You need the right skills. In this video, I'll take you through the top 10 must-know skills to become a generative AI engineer in 2025 and beyond. Each skill is backed with real-world relevance, surprising data, and examples you can relate to. Let's dive in. First up at number 10, Python programming. Python is the universal language of AI. It's clean, versatile, and has libraries like NumPy, Pandas, PyTorch, and TensorFlow that make building AI systems possible. Imagine trying to train a large language model without Python. It's nearly impossible. Even the world's biggest AI projects, from OpenAI's GPT to Meta's Llama, are built with Python at their core. Here's the kicker. Almost every AI-related job posting in the US lists Python as a required skill. Not optional, required. That makes it the single most indispensable tool in your toolkit. At number nine, we have machine learning fundamentals. Generative AI might sound advanced, but at its heart, it's still powered by the basics of machine learning. This includes supervised and unsupervised learning, decision trees, regression models, and understanding critical concepts like bias, variance, and overfitting. Why is this important? Because without strong ML fundamentals, you'll struggle to explain why your generative model is producing certain results, or worse, failing. And trust me, in an interview, that's where many candidates lose out. But here's a data twist. The U.S. Bureau of Labor Statistics projects a 32% increase in data science jobs between now and 2033. That's nearly four times faster than the average growth rate across all occupations. So yes, ML fundamentals are your entry ticket to a booming career. Number eight is deep learning and neural networks. These are the power engines of generative AI. Without them, we wouldn't have tools like ChatGPT or Stable Diffusion. You need to know how CNNs work for vision tasks, how RNNs process sequences, and most importantly, how transformers have revolutionized the entire field. Here's a wild stat. Job postings for AI engineers shot up 143% in a single year. Companies don't just want someone who knows the terms, they want someone who can explain backpropagation, activation functions, and attention mechanisms with confidence. If you can do that, you're already ahead of the curve. At number seven, natural language processing, or NLP. This is all about teaching machines to understand, process, and generate human language. You'll need to master tokenization, embeddings, and how models like BERT and GPT handle context. Remember, language is messy. Sarcasm, slang, typos, and even cultural context all matter in NLP. And here's the surprise. The NLP market is projected to reach $43 billion by 2025. Salaries follow the trend. Mid-level NLP engineers can make up to $170,000, while top experts earn $231,000 or more. So if you can build systems that actually understand language the way humans do, you won't just be in demand, you'll be in the top salary bracket. Number six is computer vision and generative models. This is where AI creates images, 3D models, or even video content out of thin air. 
we're talking about GANs, diffusion models, and autoencoders, the technologies behind tools like Midjourney and DALI. And the demand is massive. Meta pays up to $230,000 for skilled computer vision engineers, while Tesla averages around $161,000 for similar roles. Why? Because visual AI isn't just for art. It powers autonomous cars, medical imaging, and augmented reality. In short, if you can make machines see and create, you'll always be in high demand. Halfway down the list, we land on number five, transformers and large language models. Transformers changed the game. They're what make ChatGPT, Claude, and Google's Gemini possible. Knowing how LLMs are trained, fine-tuned, and deployed is no longer a nice to have. It's mandatory. Here's a stat that proves it. U.S. AI-related job listings grew 25% year over year in quarter one, 2025. And the median salary for AI roles is now close to $157,000. That's proof that companies are investing heavily in LLMs and the people who can work with them. At number four, we have prompt engineering. Think of this as the art and science of talking to AI models. Small changes in wording can completely transform the output of an LLM. This makes prompt engineers incredibly valuable. And here's the jaw dropper. Salaries for prompt engineers in 2025 now range from $95,000 to $270,000. Just a few years ago, this job didn't even exist. Now it's one of the fastest growing roles in tech. If you can design prompts that are efficient, reliable and reusable, you'll stand out in interviews and at work. Number three is data engineering and ML ops. Why does this matter? Because even the best AI models are useless without clean structured data and smooth deployment pipelines. That's where ML ops comes in. Handling training workflows, monitoring models, and automating retraining when things go wrong. Here's the surprise fact. AI-related jobs are twice as likely to offer parental leave and three times more likely to include remote options compared to traditional tech roles. That shows how companies are competing to attract and keep AI talent. And number two is responsible AI and ethics. This is about making sure your AI isn't biased, unsafe, or harmful. Think of cases where AI misclassifies patients in healthcare or where models generate offensive content. These aren't just technical issues, they're legal and reputational risks. By 2025, nearly 47% of large organizations reported having experienced at least one AI-related issue tied to bias, fairness, or privacy. That's why companies now look for engineers who can ensure their models are trustworthy and compliant. Being skilled in responsible AI makes you more than just a developer. It makes you a leader. And finally, the number one skill for 2025 is agility, the ability to keep learning and adapting. Generative AI is evolving faster than any technology in history. What you learn today might be outdated in six months. The best engineers are not just coders. They're constant learners, experimenters, and adapters. Here's the kicker. Generative AI job postings in non-tech roles grew seven times from 2022 to 2024, while broader IT roles saw a 35-time growth. That's proof that agility is the most valuable skill of all because no matter how the field shifts, adaptable engineers will always thrive. To wrap this up, the median salary for AI engineers in the US is now around $145,000, with top talent making $200,000 to $250,000 or more. So if you're building your career in 2025, these 10 skills are your roadmap. Python, ML, deep learning, NLP, computer vision, transformers, prompt engineering, 
MLOps, responsible AI, and agility. Which of these skills are you working on right now? Let me know in the comments. I'd love to hear your story. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell so you never miss an update. The AI future is coming fast and you don't want to be left behind.